any boy. That's just great. Oh. oh. I do have a recording of the Marif talking boy. sexy to Serena, the custom bot's favorite squeeze. Nah, that wouldn't work. We could blackmail him. Sport of kings. Yahtzee! Let's go find ourselves one soon-to-be outraged customs claptrap. Get that recording ready, Mox. <laughs> It's the sport of kings. Is that the fault? Come back here! I am the law! The law doesn't make mistakes! Hey. Hey! Lawbot! You've just interrupted an officer carrying out his duty! Uh, we're here to file a complaint. Your awesome Marif's been breaking the law. We have evidence. Breaking the law? Why don't you tell me all about it? Thank you for your concern, citizen. Rest assured it shall be logged. Long live the Marif! Mox, hit it! Oh, blimey, you really know how to listen to a bloke's problems. I'll give you that. You sure I can't book you for more, uh, uh physical services? I'm a bloody stress volcano right now, and I can do with the, uh, with the, uh, relief. You know that's not what Geisha bots are programmed for. Serena, really? I'm your Marif. You've been doing your Republic service. I'd make it worth your while. I'm swimming in dial money right now. <laughs> the mayor is interfacing with my Serena. No! I feel so betrayed! And according to my records, the mayor doesn't have the appropriate paperwork to engage in such activities, which kind of makes my outrage morally justifiable. Awesome! Hey, I'm with you, pal. Word is, he's got another appointment booked with Serena right now. What? Citizens, that was not. That may have sounded like my voice, but I, 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 I've been impersonated by someone who sounds like me. I, I, I appreciate you allowing me privacy at this difficult time. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. This man has no shred of honor. This guy's so busted. Without an inter-organic fraternization license, I'm gonna make his life a living hell. Come on, oh, elevator, what? let's go! Serena, I'm coming, my love! This is more like it. Oh, it's the it's those one bots from the flyers. And here we go! To the Marif! Seriously? You idiot machine? The offices are off! Right! I'm such a kidder! Up we go! They can just walk through it. Because they're NPCs. Bullshit. Welcome Do you want to be an NPC? I mean, half the time I and be controlled by the code? Warning. Trespassing on government property will result in your immediate death. Thank you. These aren't going to stop us, Huckster! Uh, look, no tools today. Sorry. Please exit through the gift shop. All right. The shop. He has a fucking gift shop. Come on! Come on! I had a more loot! Just keep shooting, fools! Down and dust it. Should have said you were dead. Should have said so. Sounded better instead. I tried. 
trace the signal that took down our systems on Helios. And guess what? <coughs> it came from here. Your office. Signal? Signal. She might be to it. Where did she come from? And please, lie to me. I really want you to lie to me. I don't know. What are you going to do with me? <laughs> Nothing. I was just messing with you. Get the hell out of here. I've been thinking there's a way back to Helios. I surrender. Oh, I was gonna let you live, you dumb bastard! What is wrong with you? Oh, that was... <clears throat> and thus starts Jack's <laughs> descent into madness. Okay, yep. yeah. Where was I? All right, my awesome master plan. Taking the fight to Helios is gonna need an army, so we make one. Head down to Springs, I'll explain on the way. I'm gonna stay here, gonna go through the Marif stuff. We're making a freaking robot army, baby, hell yeah. Shopping list simple, some serious combat chassis and top of the line military AI to run them. Word is, Springs is a lady for the AI. Hey Mox, you know where I can build me some kick-ass robot bodies? Since that giant laser is gonna kill, well, everyone, I know who might be willing to scout around why for hardware. The button? Let me talk to them and get back the to The button, you. why not? Sounds good. Let's hustle, people. We got a moon to save. What did you think of Jack when you first met him, Will? Considering he was the guy Moxie left you for, I didn't like him. You don't like anybody. I like Brick. Booyah! Booyah! <laughs> I like Brick. <laughs> Booyah! Honestly, who doesn't Brick? like Brick? Yeah, who doesn't like Brick? Brick's adorable. Oh. My muscles hurt so much. <sighs> there goes the laser again. That laser just keeps on coming. Big soz, but your best bet's a mate of mine, a little ankle biter by the name of Pickle, lives in the Outlands. He's almost impossible to reach mine, but I can help with that. Take this scrambler. Now then, I'll upload coordinates of an old Dahl garage to your Echo. Get going, I'll explain on the way. Yeah. The Looking for work? G'day. My grinder, <laughs> Bessie, finally died and I need to scrounge up a couple of spare parts. Grinder parts don't grow on trees, but luckily I got wind of two scab grinders you can uh, investigate. Don't worry, they're both stolen, so it's not like you'll be robbing honest folk. The first one's on the back of a buggy. I'm sending the coordinates to your Echo. Let's go shopping. This so... is deadlift. See deadlift lift. See deadlift oh, two lifts become one. dead. See yeah, how happy this funny. makes Still. Janie? Very so... happy. Um. Quality, not quantity. Increase gun damage and fire rate from using guns of blue rarity or greater. G decrease gun damage and fire rate when using guns of green variety or lesser. Next level, rare gun damage plus 5%, rare gun fire rate plus 3%, peasant gun damage minus 1%, peasant gun fire rate minus 1%. Reset skill points. <clears throat> Time to hone my skills. He was a corrupt Hey, look at that. Kill skill. Killing an enemy increases movement speed and damage resistance. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I am gonna reset my skills to get out of the cold money tree for a bit until we get down the thing. So we're gonna have to uh, redo the contract. You increase damage to enemy enemy with less than fifty percent of their max health remaining, or speed. <laughs> increase damage or speed. I don't think mm. 
So now whenever I kill somebody, I will increase your Speed. shields. Excellent. <laughs> what the fuck? Did it not work? There it goes. There, see? Now your shields increase too. <laughs> you can never be too well armed. <laughs> So I'm essentially just doing a buff thing again to keep you alive. Basically. Meanwhile, I'm... Speed damage! <gasps> and evidently bleed as well. <clears throat> Nurse Nina. Good at looking after himself. I have big problem. Medical refrigerator should break. Organs, tissue samples, dinner, all get formed soon. I need special ice. It keeps things cool long time. You fetch special ice from special place. I pay you. Yes? Sounds cool. That pun was not intentional. I apologize. Yes, it's good. You take drill now. That's drill. a big ass drill. Yes, uh -huh. Jesus. happy. You take drill and go now. Get special ice. Get special ice. You just stole from that guy's box. <laughs> and guess how little I care. Giant laser's gonna destroy this little is that laser cares? Probably. <laughs> Deck 13 and a half. Sheriff's dead. Nothing better, of course. Warp speed! It ain't easy to get to Pickle's place on foot, but I can help you out with. Ready for it? A stingray. It's old Dal Tech. They're not much to look at, but Moxie tinkered with the design, so now they jump like a skag in heat. Problem is, stingrays aren't easy to get your meat hunks on. So happens that Scrambler, uh, came my way. It's supposed to unlock digestructing at the old Dal garage I'm sending you to. Once you unlock a stingray there, I'll fix it so all moon zoomies are stingrayed up. Dying? It sounded like it. Oh, those are some big rockets. Search the debris and find me the unassembled linkage. Should be one. They're super tough bits of kit. here is toast. No worries. There's still that second grinder. It's in a bandit camp set up in an old train station. It's run by some feral scavs called the Boosters. If you like, you could go over there, explain I need some spare parts. They'll be all, oh, sure thing. Help yourself, mate. Ha, right. I'm updating your echo now. Go kill those crook sons of taints. Sons of taints. Don't ask nicely. Stuff. Want a race? I'm your man. Boy! It's a race. So? 
I will allow you hey, to do it. Peach. Who are you? <laughs> Gonna try and break my record, eh? Good luck. I meant that sarcastically. You should look that word up. Nobody can handle pop racing better than the Lone Stalker. <laughs> well, we'll see, won't we? <laughs> Whatever. I'm the best, end of. Get yourself a moon buggy Happy and prove kids. me wrong. Hey. <clears throat> I want to take a look fine. Ah, you found that snow guy's crap, did you? I'd love to see you wipe the floor with him. So would everyone else who's ever met him. Head over to the start line. Let's see what you can do. The countdown will begin once you're at the start line. Kick it in the gut soon as the beacons light up. Beat the kid's lap time and rub the grub's face in it. Uh, lame. You can't catch the loon stalker. Check that. If you also beat him on the first go at it, I'll give you even more credits. Show the little darling who's boss. <gasps> Initiating countdown. Five. Four, three, two, two and a half. Two and a quarter. <laughs> and then... One go. And they're off. I can hear my amazing skill pumping through my veins. Oh no, what happens if I'm so skilled I explode? God, I need this child. Hey Springs, did your driver forget which pedal to press? Come on, let's give the kids something to think about. This is where having two people doing it can be useful. Oh yeah, mate! You found a moon zoomie! Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. You cheated! Oh, and I wasn't God. feeling well! And then oh. I got something in my eye, and I that couldn't see properly. And someone distracted me, and it's not fair. Ha! Suck eggs, napkins. You just got beat <laughs> first time. <laughs> Fucking Vault one Hunter, second on the You can clock. collect your winnings from the darling little angel himself. <laughs> Dad, a super cool woman with an awesome sword just totally cheated hey. me out of the god's record. Dad, a super cool woman just be, with a really cool sword just beat out of the car sucker. Oh, uh, Moonstalker Senior is not exactly a huggable yes at the best of times. I should have seen this coming. Well, we He's beat dead. a kid, killed his father. Now he's an orphan. I consider this a win. <laughs> oh god. The time is coming when this land will be blasted oh, clean of warlords and petty kings and queens. The People's Liberation Army are storm clouds on the horizon. Bring us guns. 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 With guns we shall bring the lightning. Bring them to our Concordia, Dead Drop. Bring enough, and you will be rewarded. Hey, take a look at my shotgun. Oh shit, that's cool. It's called a Boomacorn. Yeah, I see the unicorn on the side. It's a big ass fucking 12 gauge. Dude, this thing ain't no fucking 12 gauge. This thing is bigger than that. <laughs> I still love the fact how I sit on this. Okay.
okay? Don't question. Just roll with it. It's like a horse when I shoot it. Oh my god! Yes. <laughs> on you. shit ton of common weapons that are cheap and come back Watch drop out. them off myself.
beneath me, I'll use it. Don't, I got it. Dost thou have no faith in me? Kill everyone in that area, so let's go over here. We <laughs> How did we get to kill the kid again? No, we didn't kill the kid, we killed the kid's father. Making it really difficult with him running away with this wildly inaccurate laser weapon. Come on, then, it's not as bad as all that. Smash your head in. Spice things up a bit. Really send a message. Set fire to a few scabs. Help clean the place up a bit. Don't forget, you'll need to do it in an oxygen rich environment. Go science! Go science! Come on in, scab. So I can light you on fire. Again, with the fire. Why is this gun not lighting him on fire? Nice. While lasers can be fired in a vacuum, they're way more effective in an atmosphere because they set fire to things. Which needs air, obviously. Try to keep up. There, I'll just use this one that I have, which will set him on fire. Yes! But don't forget, lasers work best when there's an atmosphere. <laughs> Yes. Move. Thank you. Good stuff. Nothing will set a scav on fire like a laser with some air to chew on. Anyone need help? <laughs> oh. You having fun? Flame in hell. I am Ready to die? Okay. Okay. Interesting. Just reading through, uh... Warning, zero atmosphere environment. Yep. Bye! There's a vehicle thing back there. You can teleport to me. It's my special time! It's my special time! Oh, 
I'll allow you to handle the brigands for me.